And oftentimes when we hold to the rigidity, we get in our own way. And, you know, that is, that is something to fear is ourself is getting in our own way and not allowing something greater to be able to happen to us that we couldn't have imagined. Yeah. And so when we can get out of our own way and allow our heart, you know, to me, that's like when we get stuck up in our head, we get in our own way. When we get into our heart, that's when we learn how to let go and surrender. And that's where the creativity and um, just all our, our creator being in the now moment like allows us to completely unfold. And, and that's when we feel like in sports. To me, that's what it means to be in the zone. We have that experience or we might experience in life as luck. But oftentimes luck is just when opportunity and persistence meet. Yeah. And so these, these are our ways of getting out of, you know, getting out of our own way, allowing life to unfold, having a, a clear plan, but being willing to be adaptable so you can reach what you desire. Yeah. So I'd like to get some clarification. Um, you said that fear, the one thing we sh should fear is rigidity. Mm -hmm. Why for you does it seem like we should fear rigidity? Um, that's uh, a good question. Um, I think for me, it's just when I feel rigidity, I feel like I am. That to me is is a the wanting to control the situation, mm -hmm. and that's me wanting to get in. I tend to get in my own way, and so it creates an outcome that I don't desire, and so I end up putting focus and effort, and then I feel tired and I feel exhausted, and then it's like oh, then the whole world is happening. Everything's happening against me, so it puts me down this path that I don't enjoy. Yeah. And so for me that that's what you know I if I were to have some kind of fear around it it is the it is a fear around that pathway. And it tends to be when I'm just get bullheaded and I get stuck you know stuck in my head this is the way it has to be and you know this I is, have this is, spoken. Yes, yes, exactly. <laughs> this is the way. You know or you know and so um you know I'm not saying it's you know the whole part of this is to release fear and let go. But that's it's again it's easier said than done it's not easy to just stop being fearful and and yeah. as we kind of talked about in a previous podcast isn't about like not having fear it's about how do you have less fear yes and so when you can identify areas you know that that's for me is a way that i can have less fear is by identifying where my fear actually exists and so it's not on the fear of change it's not in the fear of transition it's not even in the fear of like i don't have a plan it's the fear that I am so stuck in one way of the plan that I'm getting in my own way.